स्वागत हम इन द कंप्यूटर लर्निंग सीरीज दैट इज लर्निंग कंप्यूटर विथ सेइंग द ब्यूटीफुल ग्रीनी साइट्स ऑफ इंडियन और भारतीय कल्टीवेटिंग फील्ड्स और फार्मिंग फील्ड्स एंड दिस इज द ब्यूटीफुल नेचुरल साइट्स ऑफ इंडियन विलेज और भारतीय विलेज इन दिस लेक्चर आई एम गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट द क्लाइंट एंड सर्वर कंप्यूटर्स एंड ऑल्सो इन दिस लेक्चर आई वुड लाइक टू टॉक अबाउट सम हाई एंड हेल्ड कंप्यूटर्स सो लेट स्टार्ट एंड नो वाट आर क्लाइंट एंड सर्वर कंप्यूटर्स सो विथ इनक्रीज पॉपुलरिटी ऑफ कंप्यूटर नेटवर्क इट हैज बिकम पॉसिबल टू इंटरकनेक्ट सेवरल कंप्यूटर्स डैट कैन कम्युनिकेट विथ इच अदर ओवर ए नेटवर्क इन सच कंप्यूटिंग इन्वायरमेंट सेवरल यूजर्स कैन शेयर सेवरल रिसोर्सेज और सर्विसेज फॉर कॉस्ट इफेक्टिव यूजेज मोर ओवर द शेयर्ड रिसोर्सेज कैन बी बेस्ट मैनेज और ऑफर्ड बाई सेंट्रली सेंट्रली सम एग्जाम्पल ऑफ सर्च रिसोर्सेज एंड सर्विसेज आर फाइल सर्वर इट प्रोवाइड्स ए सेंट्रल स्टोरेज फैसिलिटी टू स्टोर फाइल्स ऑफ सेवरल यूजर्स ऑन ए नेटवर्क प्रिंट सर्वर it manage one or more printers and accept and processes print request from any use in a network similarly database server it manage a centralized database and enable several users on a network to have shared access to same database and the last one is name server it translates names into network addressing enabling different computer on a network to communicate with each other in this case it is usual to have one process that owns a resources or service and is in charge of managing it this process accepts request from other processes that want to use the resource or service the process that own the resource and does this management is called a server process and the computer on which the server process runs is called a server computer because it service request for use of the resource other processes that send service request to the server are called client process and computers on which client processes run are called client computers here it is to note that there may be multiple client computers sending service request to the same server computer in so in client server computing environment it is common for a server to use services of another server and hence both a client and server at the same time for example let us assume that a client server computing environment has clients a file server and a disk block server any client can send a file access request to the file server server on receiving such a request the file server checks access rights etc of user making the request however instead of actually reading or writing the file block itself it send a request to the desk block server for accessing requested data blocks request to the disk blocks so disk block server returns requested data blocks to the file server which then extract actual data from the data blocks and return it to the client in this scenario 
द फाइव सर्वर इज बोथ ए सर्वर एंड ए क्लाइंट इट इज ए सर्वर फॉर क्लाइंट्स बट ए क्लाइंट फॉर द डिस्क ब्लॉक सर्वर हेंस द कंसेप्ट ऑफ क्लाइंट एंड सर्वर कंप्यूटर इज प्योरली रोल बेस्ड एंड मे चेंज डायनेमिकली एज द रोल ऑफ कंप्यूटर चेंज सो वी सी दिस इज अ जनरल कैरेक्टरिस्टिक्स ऑफ ए सर्वर कंप्यूटर एंड क्लाइंट कंप्यूटर दैट इज ए सर्वर एंड क्लाइंट कंप्यूटर्स आर रोल बेस्ड कंप्यूटर्स दैट इज ए कंप्यूटर कैन बिहेव एज ए सर्वर एंड ए सर्वर कैन बिहेव एज ए क्लाइंट डिपेंडिंग ऑन देयर रोल्स नाउ सी सम हैंडल कंप्यूटर्स ए हैंडल कंप्यूटर्स इज ए स्मॉल कंप्यूटिंग डिवाइस डेट कैन बी यूज बाय होल्डिंग इन हैंड obviously its size weight and design are such that a user can use it comfortably by holding it in hand so it is also known as palm top because it can be kept on a palm and operate and can be operated these computers are becoming computing device of a choice for people requiring computing power anytime anywhere there are many types of handheld computers available today and some popular ones are like tablet pc so first we know about the tablet pc a tablet pc is a pc is a mini miniaturized laptop it usually provides all feature of a laptop with uh, some differences or some enhancements these are the features of a tablet pc first is lightweight a tablet pc that is a tablet personal computer is much lighter than a laptop for weight reduction their designers remove from their basic structure a few infrequently used devices such as optical drive and provide them as a separate add on next feature is hand writing recognition Usually a tablet PC comes with a special design pen that a user can use to write directly on the screen. Underlying operating system translates the pen movement to smooth plot lines that running application can understand as handwritten input. Next feature like a screen flip a user can rotate turn around and flip the screen of a tablet PC over the keyboard area. When a user flips the screen over the keyboard it hides the keyboard and leaves only the screen visible and usable in this configuration the user holds the tablet pc in hand and uses it as a digital tablet the display on the screen shows the content in a portrait mode in this configuration the another features of a tablet pc is voice recognition usually tablet pc is have a voice recognition recognition feature that allows voice input capable application to accept audio or voice command in addition to voice command this feature also enables input of voice data and next is the special design for tablet use when a user flips the screen in tablet mode he see cannot use the keyboard because the screen hides it apart from voice and hand written recognition some quick access hardware keys and some on a screen programmable software keys are present a user can use this keys to invoke predefined action that he cannot make with pen or find it difficult to make with pen Now the next uh, handheld device is PDA or Pocket PC. It is also called uh, Personal Digital Assistant and introduced initially as a Personal Information Manager (PIM) devices. Its features include contact list, calendar, task list, email, pocket word processing application, pocket spreadsheet application, presentation viewer, and a host of other applications that come in handy while on the move. PDA has a different size LCD touch screen with a pen for hand re- writing recognition it usually has a PC based synchronization utility that a user can use to transfer and synchronize 
identify data between PC and PDA. With add on memory card, a user can increase or uh, increase its storage as required. Some PDA also provide USB extension port which a user can use to connect to external devices for extended features like external monitor, LCD projector. Almost all PDA has some digital camera capability, capability as well. Now newer PDA are pack network, uh, also pack network capability using Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, etc. Due to network connectivity of some PDAs have application in many domains such as medicine, teaching, training, sport, data collection and global positioning system based location and route root finder. Several PDAs also provide GSM GPRS service connectivity and thus their users can use them as a phone for making and receiving cell phone calls. SMS CTC. PDA using some uh, operating system are MS Windows Mobile, Palm OS, Symbian OS, Linux, Blackberry OS CTC. The next uh, handheld computer device is the a smartphone. And today, a smartphone is very much popular. And it is a fully functional mobile phone with computing power. The major distinction between a personal digital assistant and a smartphone is that PDA is mostly a computing platform like PC with optional phone capability, while a smartphone is a cell phone with PDA-like capability. In a sense, a smartphone is device-centric, whereas PDA is data-centric. Normally, a smartphones do a smartphones have a touch screen and are smaller than even PDAs. In addition, a user can use a smartphone with one hand, whereas PDAs usually requires both hands for operation. So these are the some uh, we have discussed some uh, uh, handheld devices and. Uh, mainly used the handheld devices like per tablet, PC, PDA and uh, smartphones. So with this uh, uh, I would like to in this lecture here and we have discussed a lot about the uh, uh, some, uh, some uh, handheld computers and also we learn in this uh, series about client and server computers. So, so I like to end this lecture here and I think you are enjoying my video very much.